about this place. Kind of looks like a junkyard. Are you sure we can build something badass up in here? Of course, Prof. The scabs make it look way worse than it is. First thing we need to do is restore the main power. Head over to the breaker room and see what's what. through the window. Let me see if I can get that cover down. Hey, dog hunter. Peace. Oh. These guys are rude. Looks like scavs have barricaded themselves inside. That security glass is vulnerable to cold. Reckon you should freeze and smash. Yeah. He's should be in this room. Just flip it on. Oh, sorry, that electrified the water. At least this place has power now. That, good people, is the sound of progress. One step closer to saving the world. Okay, let's get down to serious business now. The first thing we need to do is complete the eye part. That's the really clever bit. I already have the process set up but we'll need the material from a few of the security bots. I was never able to get them myself. Well, let me guess. All brains, no balls. <laughs> yeah, something like that. The little buggers back quite a punch. Head back to the security office that looks over the main room and call them in. Of course, that might attract more scabs too, so be prepared. Lab. I'll walk you through the process. It should already be set up. Okay, just place the pieces in that converter over there. It'll melt down the raw materials and form the prototype eye. An eye converter? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard of. Why the hell would they make an eye converter? They didn't make it. I did. I was here for a long time preparing this lab for my prototype. This is highly sensitive experimental technology. Really? Because it looks like a toaster. See? 
here it goes. All my hard work finally paying off. We're seeing history in the making. <laughs> Okay, now pick it up. That looks incredibly dangerous. I like it. Okay, now head back to the main room. We need to plug that baby into the main torso. <laughs> Flip that match and the cage should open. That's what we're building? Oh, I was so close to finishing this when the scabs arrived. It'll pump out a lot of robots, enough to make the difference against Dahl or whatever they are. It's, uh, looks kind of like a dumpster wrapped in sadness. Hey, no offense. This constructor will be able to digistruct highly complex machines at an unsurpassed rate. Now that's done, we need to mount the torso onto the crane system. Installation. You know, you could just copy me. It takes a little longer, but it's the same thing, and I'd find it much less terrifying. Exactly how much less terrifying? It's the difference between brain surgery and being scammed. Uh, let me think about it. That's good. That's good. Now we need to attach the turrets, then the legs. Targeting systems. Oh, that's okay, thanks. I've got a fast way to do that. So nearly there! Feels like mercenary day! So the 
this is going to be my new home, huh? Not sure I want to move in. Right. The legs are in the other lab. They're still attached to an experimental version of the dial power suit. So you'll need to separate them and get them into the crane system. How about I take over the power suit, then walk the legs to where they can be assembled? Wouldn't that be easier? Hey, that's not a bad idea. I didn't even think of that. It'll be a nice warm-up for you. Never was good with direction. Mm. Okay, plug me in. strange arms legs is this what it's like to be human this is the worst all right let's see what you can do scabs in a puddle. I did, didn't I? Everything's lost like tears in a puddle. They just attack me on sight. Don't humans ever try talking oh. to each other? <laughs> this is what you do for a living? Me brother, uncle. I love this place. Oh, 